Welcome back Mechanical AI. Did you know that the entire performance of the internal combustion engine can be stripped down and dedicated to a few major parts? This makes us wonder, what are major parts of an IC engine? Before we jump in, check the previous part of the series to learn about what valves are. Now, there are three major components of an internal combustion engine. First is a cylinder head assembly, which consists of intake and exhaust valves and their respective cam shafts. The cylinder head assembly sits right on top of the engine block and controls the intake of fuel, the combustion of fuel and finally the exhaust of residue gases. The cam shafts above the valves control the opening and closing of the valves. The head assembly also contains a spark plug which, as the name suggests, ignites the fuel by means of an electric spark. Shown here is a Chevrolet 4-cylinder aluminium head assembly complete with intake and exhaust valves. Second comes the piston assembly, which consists of a piston and the connecting rod. The ignited fuel pushes the piston down which transfers this energy through a connecting rod into the third and final major component, the crankshaft, which is connected to a flywheel and harmonizes the jerky movements of the piston assembly into smooth rotations. All of these components are located inside the engine block. Shown here is a 4-cylinder 5-liter Mustang engine block with all the pistons assembled. Hence, we first saw what cylinder head assembly is and then went on to see what piston head assembly and crankshaft are. So like, subscribe and comment with your feedback to help us make better videos. Thanks for watching. Also, thanks a lot for those constructive comments. You helped the channel grow. So, here are the top mechanical EIs of our last videos. In the next episode of Mechanical EI, find out what jigs and fixtures are.